G'day and welcome back course. The question is how can you maintain the progress you're already making? And again, EFT comes in really handy here. We can use EFT to tap on all those beliefs about things you've had in the past that you've tried and not persisted with. So let's get straight into the tapping. Back on the karate chop point and repeating after me. Even though I've tried things in the past and they haven't lasted. I choose to appreciate myself for beginning yet again. Even though I've tried things in the past, I've stuck with them for a little while, but then I go back to my old habits. I choose to love and appreciate myself. Even though I'm afraid that this is just going to be one more thing I've tried and failed at. I choose to love and appreciate that part of me that doesn't want me to fail, that doesn't want to feel that way. Even though I'm afraid that I won't be able to maintain this. then I'm afraid I'll drop back to my old habits. I'm afraid I'll drop back to my old ways of thinking. Then I'm afraid I can't change in the way I want to. Even though all these fears come up, about whether I can really make the changes I desire. I choose to love and appreciate myself. And I choose to begin to notice every day those little bits of progress that I'm already making. I'm paying special attention to the, thing, to the things that are working for me. I'm paying attention to how my thoughts are different. And even as I begin to notice these changes, I can celebrate in a way that supports even more progress. Even though I'm still afraid that this won't last. I choose to give myself permission to notice when it's not working. And when I notice that it's not working, I can know that it is working. Because I wouldn't know if it was not working unless it was working. Even though I'm afraid I can't maintain this, I choose to be gentle and compassionate with myself, supporting myself in a way that's right for me celebrating my progress and being forgiving when I fall down. It's not a how many times you fall down it counts. It's how many times you get up that makes the real difference. It's been a real pleasure being able to work with you and I look forward to hearing your comments.